Feeny Todd. What's up with that? Maybe I gotta clean this. Hey, how's it going, whoever that is? How you doing? I'm just cleaning my camera. Don't mind me. Cleaning my camera. I don't know if that helped. Oh, Marty, what's up? Marty's in the hizzy. But she's Did I really say that? Come on. Well, just trying to get some lighting set up here. So, oh, hey, look at that. I look brown and now. <laughs> Word up. Tilt this down. Let's try that. Now let's find you rid of this shadow on this side. Masking a lot, huh? Fa boom! Look at that. Live in color. It's going well. I scored Ugh, so hard today. Ugh. Okay, so I'll tell you, and then I'll probably tell people again. But remember, yesterday I showed you that VCR is a Magnavox. It was ten bucks. I picked it up for five bucks. Um, brought it home. Plugged it in. It had a tape in there. What was it, the mummy? And it was like, it sounded like a 1952 truck that had never been tuned. It's bad. Not good. So I took it back. I'm like, dude, this don't work. It's junk. I want credit or something. So he's like, all right, cool. So I went and uh, found some stuff. And after all was said and done, after I paid, after I got my $5 credit and my 50% off, because it's 50% off everything, um, I paid $4.98 today. Just a little teeny tiny haul. All fit in this box right here. But it's a few things that I've been eyeballing for a while. And I wasn't ready to pull the trigger on it because I just didn't think it. Eh. But for 50% off, that changed the game a little bit for me. Not that it was big money, but, you know, when I can score this. Uh, Ready? I'm not going to show you the big score first because, you know, can't do that. Can't show you the good stuff first. I'll show you the little stuff. And this is more for me, but I do need to look these up. At least one of them in here. These are a buck. Yeah, they're just Matchbox cars. Um, but I'm a boy and I like to play with Matchbox cars. So, uh, this is just an orange one. And it's pretty cool. It's called, uh, I don't know, I'm sure you don't care. Uh, but a fire truck. Fire trucks, people like those. I like fire trucks. And, ooh, it's a tow truck with the cab over. Boom. That's awesome. Hi, Thrifty Christy. How are you? What is new? This is the one that I wanted right here out of that whole batch. Oh, crap. It looks like it's a 56 Corvette. Oh, shoot. What did I do? What did I just do? My camera's still on. I'm still there. Okay. I, I dropped this. Anyways, this is from 1982. I'm like, I remember having this one. It's a little Corvette. It's not pristine, but people collect these things, man. So that was the one that I really wanted. This is a newer one. It's got white wheels. 2013. Kind of an off-road kind of thingy. This is my version. Send me a picture of the Ruse driver. Cool. Hi, Picasso Cat Treasures. I checked out some of your videos. And I like them. I do, I do, I do. For sure. Okay, so you know how all the girls are doing jewelry uh, bags and jewelry jars? Well, I, I, what do I know about jewelry? But I can do the Hot Wheels bags for the guys, right? So when some dudes get in here, <laughs> or the girls, maybe like these. Um, but this is a cool little, what is that? Shoot, I don't know. But it's nifty. Um, here, ooh, look at that. It's about a 95 Camaro convertible. Everybody's seen those. Okay, so that was a buck. Now, if you go to the store and you buy them new, they're a buck a pop. So, haha, I used to play with cars as a kid. As a kid? Why did you stop? <laughs> oh, I got a school bus. Woohoo! District 2. Word up. I like it. Um, little tactical vehicle. A little off road in action. Very cool. Uh, this is a newer one too. 
See, I'm not much for the newer ones. I like the old ones, man. The dents. And this is the whole reason I got this bag. This also was a dollar. And this thing is bent. But it's a Camaro, man. The old Z28 Camaros with the doors that open. But it's been hammered. Look at that. You can't really tell, but it's been. Oh, the doors do open. It had T-tops. That's fresh. Yeah. That's cool. All right. I do have something that you guys are, the ladies are going to dig. You're going to fall out of your chair over. I'm pretty sure. I hope. Oh, uh, it looks like a Chevelle SS. Pretty sweet. Um, ooh, a tank. What's the year on that one? 1973 tank. I could go for that. Going to an anime come this weekend. So we're on our way now. We're driving. Oh, cool. Here is one for the little racers, little speed racer people. It's transparent, which is cool. Okay, so that's that, that's that, that's that. Here's one more in here. This is a... What is that? Oh, it's a Pagani Huyara. Whatever that is. Pretty cool. Okay, so we've got four people in here, and I'm just barely through the, the fun stuff that I like. Okay, I've got one more bag here, guys. One more bag. And then I love taking pictures of little cars because it's like a big car. Yeah, get out of town. Sure. Oh, that's fresh. Look at that. I don't know what it's called, but it's cool. It's got gold wheels and a big old motor. Gold grill. Woohoo. I like it. Ooh, look at that. Candy Apple Red 69 Camaro. Boom. Oh, okay. It's 68 Camaro. My bad. And it's from... I don't see a date on it. But everybody loves a 68, 69 Camaro. What's the date on this thing? You know, and it's just like the jewelry with these cars. Every one of them is probably not going to be worth anything. But there's going to be one out of a bag that is going to be the one. Wow, that's cool. Never seen anything like that before. See right through it. I like it. How about that? Hey, Amelia Sells. How you doing? Nice to see you here. Good to see you. Good to see you. Oh, look at that. It's uh, any car. Must be from the movie Cars or the like. So that's that. For those of you who just stopped in, this is my version of a jewelry unveiling, but it's Matchbox Cars. Here's a really cool cab over semi. year on that bad boy it's kenworth 81 81 i like it what is this oh it's a batmobile Woohoo! it's a scar people like batmobiles and it's a weird looking one it's like the front end is huge and the back end's tiny it's like it's out of proportion strange that was a kenworth that's a kenworth Let's see what this one is. Ooh, it's shiny. It's black. It's called a uh, don't know from 2012. That's awesome. I wanted it because of this. I know it's not a Hot Wheels, but it is a Pacer. It's from the movie Cars, and I don't think I have the Pacer over there. So I love my. You know, I've never been to an anime convention. I would love to go. That would be cool. So, Mari and Thrifty and Amelia, this is Picasso Cat Treasures. She is new to our channel, or to the channel. Oh, look at that. It's like a, a Star Wars Speed Racer, but not. Look at that. A pod racer, I mean. That... Is really cool and has white wall tires. I'm all geeking out over toys. Last but not least, oh, this was the other reason I got this. Not just the pacer, but it's got a little Mario uh, wagon of some sort. So that should sell. Yeah, he's not staying. So that's it for the Hot Wheels. That was a total of uh, $3. And I know that there's more than 3 bucks in Hot Wheels there, obviously. Um, so that's that. We're going to go to the next little thing. 
It's a little thing, but it's cool. It goes along the same lines as the game I showed you the other day, which was the uh, Powerpuff Girls. Right, the Powerpuff Girls. Well, for 25 cents, I picked up a purple because it was 50, so it was half price. Buttercup Girl with a little dilly on it still. A little bag. And uh, it's clean. Cartoon Network from 1999. So that's what? 19 years old. It's a cool little purse. And man, this would be great for vacation or going to the arcade. Put all your quarters or your whatever's in there. Not too big. That is cool, man. See? So for 25 cents. Next. Let me see here. Is uh oh she's not here yet. I wonder if she's gonna stop in. Uh my thrifted escape. She does the hats. And I saw this and I thought of her. The Texas AM, the Aggies, and it's a nice fitted hat. Gray. Uh it's called a one fit, top of the world. And uh it's very nice. Very nice. Oh, where's my other hat? This one I picked up more for me because uh, I've been liking to wear just all black hats, you know, just totally black. Um, and this one's black with some white. So maybe and it's nothing fancy. Let's try it on. Boom. See, that's cool. I like it. All right. Now, I know there are some crafters here. There's got to be some crafters out of four of you. Um, and I saw this about a month ago and I can't remember what price was on it then. I don't even know if I had a price on it then, but, uh, I passed on it and passed on it, passed on it. And then I kept saying, Oh, I'm going to look it up. I'm going to look it up. I know it's a crafter thing cause it's called creative gear made by creative gear. So I reckon you put all your doodads and doodillies in there like that whatever's and uh i don't know if it opens up in the middle it doesn't but you can hang it up and it's two-sided for all your things so that was 50 cents and i bet you that's gonna be 10 bucks i mean i have no idea but something tells me at least that um here's my mail a couple bills anybody wants to pay those you can take care of that one and that one and then some it looks like our house insurance stuff so that's cool so you let me know <laughs> Uh, all right. Uh, I haven't got to the really good thing. And this is a small haul, guys. Seriously. <clears throat> I saw this a week ago. And it was three bucks then. And I'm like, nah, I don't really need that, you know. But for a buck fifty, it's made out of wood. It has the old style of sheets in the middle. So they'll have to be, someone have to put whatever else in the middle. But it's just a really cool old it's on both sides held together by leather and i don't know if there's a maker on this thing i doubt it i don't know but it's very cool you know i could totally see someone using that for something that's neat so <clears throat> along those lines i picked up this other one and i saw this there about a month ago someone should take family photo yeah there you go I like that vintage. Yeah, it is. I would say it's probably late 60s, early 70s, or based on colors and font and style. Yeah, I'd say probably 70s on up because the orange, and the whole thing. Because wood and orange were big in the 70s, I believe. This is a also a memory book, but it's a new version. And it's very nice. I mean, it's nice. Uh, it's made by Creative Images. Or no, sorry, Creative Memories. Excuse me. So I picked this up for a buck fifty. It's brand new. And it is a, just a really, really nice photo album. You know, high quality, beautiful photo album that should fetch some decent cash. So that's that. Um, okay, guys, we're getting close. Ready? <clears throat> oh, someone left. Man, that sucks to be you. I wish you should have stayed because I'm about to show you something crazy. Ready? Okay, this is the last next to the last crazy thing. This, I don't know, I haven't looked these up. 
image as well. I just saw you flood. Cool. Marty, if you're out there, bust out your Google. It's called Aerosols Shoes. They need to be cleaned up just a little bit on the bottom. But they're very, very nice. And the reason I got them is because, well, the quality of them, you can just see the quality. Um, it had the box. has all the stuff inside of it. And there was another pair of shoes there with a box with all the stuff inside of it as well. And the other pair was the ones I saw first. And I grabbed them once I saw them. And I'll show you those. And based on this pair right here, I picked up that pair thinking, okay, well, I'm sure they don't belong to the same person because when they go through and put stuff out, a lot, it, that's how it happens. You know, everything is put out, whatever. So these are by a company called Stuart Wiseman. Weitzman. Go ahead and Google that for me, Marty. See what you come up with. These are, I would call them uh, loafers. Made in Spain. They're both in very, very, very nice condition. Lightly worn. I mean, there's... Uh, my camera's not going to pick it up. Okay, there. So, they have been worn, but not bad. I mean, you know, once I clean them up, they're going to look great. Um, the center, you can tell the center's not even worn out. Um, has all the this stuff in here, you know. So I'll put everything back in there. But when I saw the price on the box and where they came from, I was like, oh my gosh. So this is it. This is my big score, guys. Ready? Here we go. They're from Nordstrom's. Okay. Nordstrom's. The price tag on them is 225 bucks. I haven't scanned them yet. But shoes are $2. I'm like, so I get those for a buck, right? Because it's half off. He's like, yeah. I'm like, all right, cool. So I got these shoes for a buck. So let's all look them up while we're sitting here live. Let's do that. And if maybe I might just fall right out of my chair. That'd be cool. I hope I do. But I saw these there yesterday. And I was like, eh. But I didn't turn them around or look at the box. But today I did. And so I'm glad that VCR didn't work, man. Glad it didn't work. Okay, let's see here. Oh, yeah, I did sell another loot crate uh, item. It was the little, uh, from the fifth element. It was like a pass thing around, you wear around your neck and a half, whatever. So I sold for $4.20 and uh, plus shipping. And I had it up there for eight ounces shipping. Ended up coming in at three. I overestimated, so then I accidentally made a buck on the shipping. So I made five bucks, five dollars and twenty cents on it was all profit because my my bro gave them to me. So now we're gonna look these up. Are they scannable? We're gonna find out. Let's see here. Christy sent me a picture. Oh yeah, they're driving. Look at that's your roommate. What's up, roommate? How you doing? Are she still on here? I don't know if she's still on here, but they are rolling. Is that a pentagram around your neck? Hexagram? Pentagram? Doo -doo -doo. All right, let's see here. I tell my wife I'm going downstairs to work. She goes, sounds like a good idea. <laughs> so as um, independent, whatever you want to call us, workers, we're independent workers. We are our own bosses. So you have to stay accountable to yourself of your time, your thoughts. Um, and I'm going to be straight up. I was terrible today. I dropped Caroline off and my whole plan was to drop her off, come home and then just get downstairs and get to listing. You know, I didn't, I came home and I looked, I was got wrapped up on YouTube and I was watching these different videos of singers, just people who can just sing, man. And just, you could just, it just moves you. It's amazing what the power of, of a singer, um, acapella or otherwise, when they got it, they got it, man. You just, uh, it's awesome. Don't forget to check the pricing on Poshmark for those shoes as well as eBay. Okay. I'm trying to search YouTube for these shoes. How stupid is he? All right, eBay. Scan for me, baby. 
nothing. All right, well, we're just going to have to do like this. Maybe it's under the Nordstrom. I don't know. Going down rabbit holes. Nope. Okay, so let's look for Stuart Weiss. Has anyone ever heard of those shoes? I have not. Not a clue. Shoes. Black suede. Black suede. New sales going down rabbit holes. You lost me there. New sales. Which rabbit holes? You know, I used to like this cologne. I wish I still had some. If anyone out there sells Avon, let me know, man. I'd like to have some black suede. That was good stuff. And these are called black suede. Oops. Black suede, are you guys ready? Dun, 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 dun. What? What are these called, though? Loafers? Oops. Oops. Okay, maybe I should put the style number in. Three W three two two seven two. Come on. Okay, so it's not pulling that up either. Oh wait. Kitten Hill. Also seen black suede. I've seen. No, I don't want the deodorants. I just want the cologne. Three two two seven two. Man, those are cool. Black suede. With the colors that buckle. What do you call that? That is not a kitten heel. Never heard of Kitten Hill. That's just a standard loafer hill. I think. Let's try that. Also seen. Nuh uh. Okay, I think these people are. Come on, man. Make me happy. That's pretty close. How could that be? Let's see. Got the feet up or what? Twenty bucks. Twenty bucks? Really? That's it? I need to do more research, man. Because how could they be retail for two twenty-five and be worth twenty bucks? You know. Hey, it's Ripper Christie. Glad you're back. You must have got back in range. What's up with the thug? Those, those are not it. Are they it? They better not be it. Very close, but these pictures suck. Okay, no, they're not the same. Um, you know, and even sometimes when uh people out there do have the same exact thing so this was i think it's still going to be a score i think it's still going to be a score i bet you they're going to go for 49 bucks after i'm done with them um because this is what i'm getting into there are times where i'll be selling the same exact thing as someone else um and they'll be asking like well for example there was someone asking like 100 bucks for something and i had the same product but i'll put up 12 really good pictures um, my descriptions never get really crazy. I mean, I basically copy and paste my title into my description and then copy and paste in my little, what you call it, standard format thing. And I'm off and rolling. Um, <clears throat> oh, 
I lost my train of thought. But so people will be like, they'll put their stuff up there and they'll be asking a good amount of money. But I'll put mine up there for more because I'm trying to bring more value to the table by better pictures. And if it's something worth putting a really good description, I do. Um, I guess I shouldn't say I should probably do it with everyone. Um, I've been spending a lot of time going through my uh, editing one by one, you know, checking my titles, taking stuff out, adding stuff in, um, and then going. My main thing is to go to the uh, description and make sure that stupid thing is uh, mobile friendly because nine times out of 10, it's not because I do all my listing on my phone. So you think if you're listing on your phone, should be mobile friendly. It's not. Um, I'm using an Android. I don't know if that makes a difference. Um, but you can go into your, when you're revising stuff and go, you see the description box right to the top of the description. You'll see right there that it says, uh, is my, whatever, is my item mobile friendly? Click on that. And if it is, it'll, it looks great. It'll be two check marks and you're good. If not, then you have to push fix it for me and do it like that. Now I know, I don't know if it's Christy or Amelia, one of you girls gave me the code for that. Where do I put it? <laughs> I don't know what I'm doing. So I'm not using it. I'm just going in and manually. Just... So, um, but that's not that big of a deal. It is if you think about it. But in reality, it's really not. I was trying to tell my mom. List with. Okay. The template I use is not like a template from eBay or anything. It's just a standard little five line thing that I've written up. It's got, you know, PayPal, uh, shit, oh, what is it? Payment, PayPal, shipping. Um, I usually ship items within one day of purchase, uh, fast shipping worldwide via USPS and global shipping, eBay's global shipping program. Um, they vary, but, uh, so yeah, so make sure you guys do that. Now I was talking to my mom a little bit earlier ago, earlier ago, earlier, and even yesterday we were talking about uh, how it can be, you can get overwhelmed. You can overwhelm yourself. You can go buy too much crap and then be like, oh no, now what do I do? Well, you know what you do? You go home and you picture it, man. And then what do you do? You list, okay? That's what you do. Uh, yesterday I bought all that stuff, okay? I came home after I was offline or whatever, I pictured it. If you go online, you'll see that a lot of it's listed um, and that's what's up. And that's what I've been trying to do. I've been trying to be more accountable to me, to me, um, and just hustle. Because at the end of the day, you know if you're working hard. You know if you're working hard or not. Or you're not. You know, and I can tell you straight up that I, I lost an hour and a half watching videos on YouTube. Can you believe that? I wasted one and a half hours watching videos where I could have been working, but I wasn't. I was just man yeah, that's good so don't do that don't do it all right guys well that haul is done my shoes and whatnot so now it's time to the second part and the second part is to so we're gonna have to move some stuff around uh one of these days before summer's over i'm gonna set up outside and do an outside photo shoot Let's bring a tote full of stuff throw up a card table and see how that works that might be fun Yes, it is very, if you came down to my basement right now, you might go, oh my God, Todd, there is a method to my madness, um, but buying stuff, that's anybody can buy stuff, you know, if you're just buying and sitting on it, saying, oh, phew, that was fun, because we all get a rush when we go and, you know, we get that little endorphin, whatever God has given us, uh, when we buy stuff, it makes us happy, so, but it's not about making us happy, it's about buying something smart. So we can flip it, right? Um, do I always do that? Nope. Sometimes I buy just because I like it. Like this hat, you know? What are you going to do? What are you going to do? Um, but I spent $4.98, and so I'm good with that because I know I got more than five bucks with the stuff here. So let's uh, move some cameras around. Or cameras, move some stuff around. Um, put some totes back up. I'm going to move you guys. Where should I put you? Yeah, I've got a mess down here, guys. I really, really do. If you could see my floor, you'd be like, holy crap. Because I've got all this stuff from my hauls that I've done. And yeah. 
I've got stuff here. I've got stuff here. So anyways, I'm just going to go over here. It's because I did my haul video and took pictures of what I took pictures of. And then we went upstairs all of the day, you know? So I've got complete chaos going on, looks like. But that's okay. I'll just keep talking and walk away. And you guys can watch while I do that. And if you do, be cool. If not, well, that's cool too. Just trying to get this out of the way here. So basically, I took an old tripod. And based on the mount on it, I think it's made for uh, <clears throat> something else. Something bigger. Like a old VHS camera deal. I'm going to put this up here on the thing. I don't know if it's going to be safe up here or not. We'll see. There we go. All right. Here I go. VCRs are everywhere. Okay. Sometimes just getting started on where do you start? I don't know. Right here. Right in the middle of it all. So all the stuff that I got from my buddy Jack Spade, I uh, keep in that tote. Keep it all in the same tote. And that way I know where it's all at. Not the mess with it. <coughs> Excuse me, I've been selling a lot of that stuff he gave me. It's pretty cool. Go like this, and go like this. Is that too much light? Too much? Okay. Oh! Get that out of the way. Take this out of the way. Like that. Close that. Pick up some trash. Picking up trash. This Caroline's. Juice thing. Do, do, do. Looking at my back though. Am I right or am I right? Munchy chee. Munchy chee, munchy chee. Oh, so soft and cuddly. Who remembers that? The munchy cheese. Holy smokes. Much stuff. Yeah. Here. All right. This all needs to be pictured. So I need to get everything put over here on my table that I'm going to picture if I get it up off the floor. Only. Okay. Slide this back. Like that. This needs to be pictured. I keep procrastinating on getting rid of my boom box, man. Hey, what's up, Glenn? How you doing, buddy? Todd, just did a small haul. I did just do a small haul. Oh, trying to find a tripod for cheap. So I can mount my phone. I have like at least three tripods. Got that one. There's another one over there somewhere. And then I've got one upstairs that I'm not quite sure what it's supposed to be, really. Bills. A and B, and C goes with B. 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 What is that? A or B? That's D. Here's a B. Here's men's. B. Another B. That's men's. And D is purses. Where did C go? Oh, C's down there. Okay, and then this is a whole bunch of other stuff. That's listed. This is backpacks. Okay. We're getting close. Closer. See, it doesn't take long once you guys start, man. You know, once you start picking up your messes, and you know what you got to do. It really is nothing but a thing to do it. But it's about the starting, the process. That, this. So I'm going to put all the stuff over here. 
gonna move this tripod so that I can uh, put get to my table over here to pick the stuff up. So move this. Oh, look out! So basically, what I did was got my tripod, got my little light, and I used some packing tape, taped it on there, and I can go up and down with it. And I put a a daylight LED bulb in there. And holy crap, I love it. Huge difference. Because I was like, man, I need to just go out and buy a lighting kit, blah, blah, blah. And yeah, I'm nice. But I've got other fish to fry, you know? So I fry those fish first and do the best you can with what you got. Yep, yep. And when I mean fish to fry, I mean bills. <laughs> All right. There's another boomer box needs to go. Set that. Actually, I don't even want to do that. I saw it one day and I came out there and I stripped. Damn. You're crazy. All right. All I want to do. Is not sound the skateboard. Shh, yeah. I'm ready to do some skating, boy. No, just joking. Okay. What do we got here? Man, Brandon, what am I going to do with you? <sighs> okay, everybody say it all together. Todd, no more shopping. Why? Because you got a million items to list. I've got 493 active. That's funny because I've got quadrillion things to list, and yet I'm like, I gotta go do a haul video because everyone needs to see a haul video. Yeah. I do. <sighs> okay. Here we go. Maybe like this. See, I, gotta, I gotta breathe my way through this stuff sometimes. What is this? New with tags. From Marisa's, 32 bucks. That's cute. What is this? New tags. Petite. Yeah. Todd, Todd, Todd. So, let me check the chat, see what's what. Todd, no mo shopping. <laughs> I know it is Drifter High. You need to show you, man. Yep, I love finding, you know, treasures. But not everything's a treasure to everybody. <laughs> to me, it is. To some people, it's not. You know, I have to try and keep that in mind. That just because I think it's awesome doesn't mean everybody does. So I'm just picking up my mess over here. And then I will get the picture. But this is a key part of your eBay business, trying to keep your crap picked up, put away. Right? I mean, but if, I guess if I saw someone's eBay space and it was completely pristine, I'd be like, I ain't working very hard. You know? Because usually it is a mess and then it gets cleaned up and then it's a mess again. And then it gets cleaned up. And it's a mess again. See, we're talking total randomness here. Random. Okay, hey, look at that. There's a little plushie, Minnie Mouse. Woohoo! She needs to go get out of here. All right. Um, this, this. I can't get the. I can't get the. Uh, Stickers off here, 25 cent stickers. I can't get them off without ripping them. These are so cool, man. From 1956 and 57. 49. This one's from 1949. It's home and needlecraft. It's called the work packet. Very cool. Amelia, but I see you. You're always you're always on top of it, trying to keep things picked up and stuff. Good. I'm glad it is oh, it crashed a little bit, you know. 
Okay, I'm gonna get really organized. I've had this thing in the background for I don't know what three months now. I was like, yeah, I'm gonna sell so yeah. Haven't sold it yet. Just keep looking at it, saying, man, that's cool. I don't know why I do that. I need to stop. I keep looking at the coffee sitting here. It's from yesterday, and I'm like, mm, should I drink it? No, don't drink it. You get sick, maybe. All right, see all the stuff. Here's a Tommy Hilfiger tie just laying there. Look at that. Jeez, Todd. Does anybody need a little gold and baby blue Tommy Hilfiger power tie? I got one laying right there amongst the whatevers. Uh -oh. That sound means I've got 8% left. I got to get my cord. I knew that was coming. I anticipated it. Because. What do I Alright. Right there. <clears throat> plug it in. Plug it in. Ready? Oh yeah. Here we go. Charging. Charging margin. Okay, I should get all put all this stuff in a box, get it out of my face, and then put this stuff up there. So got this box. Trash. 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 Okay. I'm gonna put this stuff that's up here in this box. Here it goes. I don't know when I'll see it again. Man, I've had this thing since I started selling. Okay, this needs to be cleaned up. Cool phone. Plus white and crap. Desert storm cards. Freaking uh pig hidden camera. Whatever. What do you call it? Nanny cam? Flush, pumping all the stuff here, man. And you know, it, it got put up here so it could be pictured, but then I get new stuff and I'm like, oh, you go to the back of the pile. And that's not cool. What I need to do is slide this in, slide that over. Oh, look at that, I forgot I had that. Oh, don't you hate when you do that? I forgot I had that. That's when you know there's a problem. Yeah, it is. Here, check it. I have a Coleman lamp lantern. I have a reason to go camping. <laughs> I did. I wanted to get this, guys. I don't even know. Oh, oh. out of control. Woohoo! I'm bugging out, yo. Nice. Huh. I'm bugging out of here later. No. <laughs> All right. That's cool. Still got the little dillies in there. Yeah, it's cool to have it. But guess what? I don't have the stuff for it. I need to grab a quick lunch. Okay. I'll we'll see you when you get back there, Marty. Go eat. We had fried chicken. Fried chicken for lunch. Fried chicken and dinner rolls. I told Caroline, you know what, let's do fried chicken and dinner rolls. I was like, I was going to do vegetable, but I think bread and chicken is good enough. So we loved our bread and our chicken. Then we had a couple glasses of water. Good stuff. Good stuff. Here's a stupid camera. It just keeps getting moved around from here to there. I'm going to take it out to the farm and shoot it, I think. Because I bought it and it doesn't work. Makes me not happy. All right. Oh, 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 oh. No, oh my gosh, you guys. Yeah. Don't mind me. Just have all kinds of crazy stuff over here. Um. How do I still have these that not listed yet? Uh, what do you call them? Those DSs. I've got two DS, three D, the PD. You know those little things the kids play. I 
Neil. Todd. Okay, speaking of Todd, I got my uh, Todd Bridges book today. I'm pretty excited about that. It's called Killing Willis. So while uh, Caroline was swimming for swimming lessons, I pulled her on the side and I read my book and I banged out 22 pages, man, in 30 minutes. It's a good book. It's one of those cover to cover readers. So, all right. We are so close. So close. Man, look at all this cool stuff. So much cool stuff. Fun. You got there. Oh, geez. Hey, look at that. Hey, Marty. Oh, Marty's not here. I have some, some gaming headphones, man. Those are cool. Uh, here's some media. All right. Sliding this stuff under here. Out of my face. For now. Oh man, look how cool this is this. I got a thing I got shit. <coughs> Great big dinosaur. Remember those? My oldest daughter wanted these so bad when it came out. This was like a hundred bucks or something or more when it first came out. I don't know what they are now. Still works. He walks, he roars, and he sniffs. Pretty cool. Pretty cool dinosaur. It's huge. Okay, transformer stuff. I'm just trying to make room down here so I can break dance. <laughs> Not really. Well, you never know what I might do. If I had a big enough piece of cardboard, I suppose I could lay down here and do some back spins, some head spins. VCR one. Uh oh. VCR two. Now these are all tested. I tested those live uh, in a show a couple of months, weeks ago or something, and they work. So I bought three, and then those work. I think I got one from a garage sale that didn't work. Here is a RCA camera, man. Look at that, big one. That's probably what that uh, tripod's for. Big old camera. We're gonna put that right there for now. Slide it out of my face. Put that right there. All right, now we've made some room. All right, that's that. Shut the thumbs door. That. Oops, knock the car over. Oh, gee, here's some Nikes. Those are pretty cool. Hey, those are almost clean enough to go right on the thing, huh? That's kind of fun. What the heck are these? Zoom air. Nice. Didn't look like you did much zooming in them. Like new. We'll put those up there. What is this? Big old lion plush. I don't know why I would ever pick that up, but maybe it's because it's cool. Maybe Carolyn wanted it. I don't know. I'll have to look it up. He's soft. Oh, I remember now. I bought these because they were cool. Initially, I thought they were Jordans from far. Then I got closer. I saw their DCs, which is still cool. Their skater shoes are not perfect, but they're still cool. There's a backdrop laying down here on the floor. Skateboard. Man, it's gonna be hard to sell this thing. Watch it. Don't sell it. Just keep it. Like, ah, I know, but I need it. Need it. Need it. You know? Yeah, it's fun to have and to ride it and stuff. But it's like, but if you can't find another one and you can't replace it, then why would you get rid of it? Well, because. Well, if you're selling stuff, not stuff. <laughs> you know? But so she's she's really cool like that. Oh supportive. Um I did throw remember I was talking about not selling these calendars. I threw them up on um just I didn't read them. 
They need to go away. They they were a hit for me that first season, or that first year of selling. They were huge. I was selling left and right. I could to for the following season to come around so I could do it again. A pair of white bands. I could put these bands up there with that skateboard, huh? Slip ons. How far would you guys drive for sourcing? Depends. I mean, if I was doing like a trip and say I was going to go meet up with several people and we we're going to do a thing or whatever, I would. Oh, and here's something else. I think I'm not going to, even though I've got tickets, they're free. I want them. 315 bucks. But I'm like, okay, well, a hotel is going to cost me, you know, for two nights, you know, 150 bucks a night or 100 bucks. Even if say it's a cheap hotel, 100 bucks a night is 200 bucks. Driving down there, you know, and back is another 100 bucks. Food, let's call it another 100 bucks. Uh, so all said and done, a free trip cost me 500 bucks. And I'm like, you know, that doesn't make good business sense. Um, it just doesn't make good sense. I, don't, I have bills to pay. I got things to do. Yeah, I like to go hang out and meet Casey, the Rockstar Flipper, and go, you know, learn a little bit at the conference and stuff. But I don't know if it's it's not. Sorry, Casey, 500 bucks, man. <laughs> but yeah, my wife's like, well, why don't you just drive down for the day? Yeah, once I get down there, I wouldn't want to leave, I'm sure. So it's better to just not go. And uh, yeah, unless something happens, I told her, unless I sell a bunch of stuff really fast, then I will. Um, but even still, I don't know. So that's that. And sometimes you have to make those calls, man. That's part of being an adult. You know, yeah, I want to go, but just because you can and you want to doesn't mean you need to. You know, it's a want versus a need. You know, I don't need, need. I don't need to. So I'm just going to have to work harder on this end to make up for whatever I didn't learn on that end. Right. Um, so, yeah, that's that. So there's the van. Here. Let me go through this over here and get rid of a lot of these books because this stuff over here is from, it's my personal collection of books and crap and it's intermingled with stuff it shouldn't be. Picture. I need to go through and look. So we'll send that right there and this right here and this right here and that right there. We have a little apron. This is trash. This is socks. And what is on this apron? Oh, yeah. Check it out. Los Polos Hermanos. The Chicken Brothers. <laughs> That's cool. I should use that when I'm outside making uh, these burgers. Yeah, it looks like too far. Man, it is pretty far. That's like driving from here to Minneapolis. Yeah, I wouldn't drive there unless I was doing a meetup and all kinds of stuff. But that's my point is, if I was going to spend 500 bucks, I'd rather just spend gas money and food money, go down and do a sourcing trip with a uh, Poplar Picker. And there's a couple of people, you know, within a two and a half hour drive from me that I could go hang out with um, if they were around. So I would rather do that than go drop money and sit and watch people talk you know what i'm saying i was gonna list these but i don't know what they are i've got pictures of them i don't know i'm gonna have to ask jack so that's that that's picked up okay guys definitely made some progress moving this naked lady right here and okay made a lot of progress now this stuff down here is just gonna go on the table this here, my phone should be charging. If I were smart, this still needs to be clean. Look at that, still needs to be clean. That easy bake oven that everyone's like, I want that, I want that. Yeah, I still gotta clean it. Hey, what's up, Charles? How you doing, bud? Glad you're here with us today. We're gonna work. The day away, taking pictures for eBay and stuff. Stuff that I can't take pictures of right now, I'll put over here. Okay, 
face because it's not ready. Stash it down here. Like stashing money under the under the mattress. Okay. Oh. And my wax Tonka truck. We're getting close. Share with those. All right. Egyptian crystals and sage sticks. Pick them up. Let's see what they look like. Okay. Sage sticks. Never heard of them. Like sage the plant. Here's something else I forgot to show you guys. Here's uh in the hall yesterday. It's a uh, Nintendo. One of them. Mario card. Marty was out. Oh, she's not here. I don't use those sticks, smudge sticks. Where's my thing? I don't even have it on. I usually have this. I don't feel right without it. I take it off in the shower. All right, guys. I'm back. I went and just grabbed my coffee. So I was gonna show you, show people what I got. Oh, she brought me home a Twix. She says, "I'll bring you some from Swimming Dad." And I said, "You don't have to." She did anyway, but it was all melted, so we threw it in the freezer, and now it's frozen. Frozen solid. So we're gonna wait so it doesn't break my teeth. <laughs> yeah. You guys are talking about smudge sticks and this and that. I don't use those. I don't know what that is. What I do have is this medicine bag that I carry. I wear. Yeah, medicine bag. That's what you call it. It's a medicine bag. Oh. And it's not an actual medicine bag. I, I bought this at. Uh, Didn't somebody make it? No, I bought it at a fort when I was on the road selling insurance. We went to some fort. I can't remember which one it was. Old fort. And in the um, gift shop, they had this kit where you could make these. It was all, you know, just the leather and the whatever. So I bought it and I made it. Can you turn that off, please? Thanks. And inside, I have a uh, piece of shungite. Oh man! And uh, it's supposed to help with a lot of stuff. You just have to Google it. Shungite. I have. Uh, I don't know what kind of rock this is, but I just like it. It has a red and black. This piece. And I don't know what it is, but when you hold it up to light, you can see it. And it's almost like a dinosaur in there. Not really, but have you ever seen Jurassic Park where they have those pieces of whatever? You can see through it. I mean, you can see through this thing. So probably nothing, but I like it a lot. So I have these three rocks I carry with me around my neck. And the Shungite mostly is the one that... Whatever, but I think it uh, it's 
grounds you or does something to your the electro elect, electricity your body puts out and takes in and it's all around us it helps to keep some of those bad ways away is what they say i don't know what do i know i know that when i wear it i feel better when i don't wear it i don't feel better so could be psychosomatic or whatever you call it psychopathic <laughs> but yeah i'm sure i confuse a lot of people when they see this they're like hey he must be a native american and then they'll see this oh he must be jewish no i'm not jewish nor native american this i look like a native american <laughs> this was my dad's it's a it's a gold um jewish symbol and it's the symbol for life and that kind of stuff on a copper necklace because copper is another thing that's good to wear uh and so yeah i'm neither native nor jewish but those people off i'm sure Ooh, I got my coffee. Is that warm? No, it's cold. It's just like room temperature coffee, which I like. Oh. I'm trying to warm this up so it will go faster so okay. I can have a bite too. I'm going to steal a bite, okay? Okay, watch out, brother. I'm just uh, picking stuff up and putting it over on the table so I can start picturing it. If you guys saw this black bag I got last night, I, I think that it's a World Traveler. Uh, I think that's, or is it World Traveler? That is a brand, I'm sure. But it's a nice black backpack kind of thing. I just pick up this whole box. This is the whole box. Duh. Caramel's not hard, Dad. Huh? I can feel it. The caramel. Yeah. It's not hard yet. Okay. Let's go outside. Trash. If you guys don't know what I'm doing, I'm just forming this Twix up so I can have a line in that. Okay, I need to put these cars away. Put my cars away, guys, real quick. Put this here and this here. Did you know this and one? I'll put them in my little holder. What? This is how you're supposed to warm up chocolate. Grandma has these caramels that look hard. Now, you put them in the, the microwave for like 25 seconds. And it warms them up and makes them like to get hard. Mm. It feels good. Try it check to get it. I didn't get it to be. I love She's cool. Cool. Oh, look, there's my iPod. I've been looking for that. <laughs> I've been looking for my iPod, man. Hi, Casey Lakeman. How are you? Yeah, she's my little helper. She's awesome. Dragon's blood. I'm so happy I found this because now I can get down, Charlie Brown. All right, that's that. Add just a little bit of chocolate. 
which actually was just more of a tease. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. What's your plan, Stan? You don't know. Look what I found. Yeah. Your iPod. I don't know. I've been looking for it. Well, both of our iPods. It was missing in action. We both share it, basically. Yeah. Yeah. What songs on it did you like? Um. Sweet Caroline? Wait, Sweet Caroline? No, I don't think there is. I would have thought. I was Wait, you know what? This wasn't the huge score I thought it was going to be because there were two twenty-five. I thought it was going to be like hundred bucks for them. Probably maybe like forty bucks. But for a dollar, I guess I can't complain. Yeah, that is. I could complain, but it wouldn't matter. This book, I'm going to keep and I'm going to cut it up and put it. This is my little my man project. I'm going to cut up different articles out of here. Advertising, because there's some advertising here that is just ridiculously awesome. Like, look at that. Imagine each one of those in a picture frame. Imagine those in a picture frame, guys. People yeah. would buy them. Yeah, well, I know something. Yeah. Uh, sometimes when I get older, I like shake and my whole body shake. Yeah. It's called the shivers. Right. Yeah, I can go see that. This. <laughs> Hey guys, I'm close. These records, I gotta try and put them on and see what music they are. This is trash. How cool is that? It's a PlayStation gun. gun. But if you cut the cord off, that'd be cool to keep too. Like, uh, you know what? Is it supposed to be orange? Yeah. I don't know. It's gray inside. Hmm. I don't know. Here we go. It's time to take the picture, though. A blank tape. Don't know what's on it. We'll file that right there next to whatever. Okay. That's that. That's that. I think we're, I think we're good, guys. I mean, you know, everything's off the floor. Probably still vacuum, but I'm not going to have it right now. Move this right there. Move this right here. I should have been charging my phone this entire time. That's okay. Just run that off. Let that charge. What else do I have down here? This is my hat. Okay, Red Ox. All right, so there you have it. Yeah, you know what, man, that Poshmark, I'm just not into the sharing thing, and I know that's going to hinder, I mean, that's what that app's all about, is sharing, and whatever, so I don't know, if I'm going to continue on with it, I've got followers, thousands of them now. Okay guys, it uh been on for one hour and nine minutes, we've got eight people watching, four likes. Go ahead and share this with one of your friends that's thinking of getting into eBay. So they can say, what is it really like? Well, you work from home. You make your own hours. You work longer hours, usually. I was laying in bed. I was listing with one eye open. I listed until I couldn't keep my eye open last night. So, <clears throat> yeah. I'm going to go upstairs and take a two-minute break. I'm going to go check out the dog. And I will be right back. So, Karma Council, thanks for popping in. Amelia Sells, Keep Karma Council Entertained. Same with you, Thrifty Christie, and Casey Lakeman. And Madi will be right back. She had to go get something to eat. I'm just going to go take a, a quick a breaker. And that's that. So I'll be right back. Hey, guys. Hang loose. Hang. You want to hang yourself? So we got done. This book 
Yo, 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 nine people. That's awesome. What's up, guys? All right. You know, what's so cool about my people, all you people? Um, 
is that I can play and you guys just do your thing right there. Oh, and then they left. <laughs> Whatever. Alright. It's on. Six minutes, Dougie Fresh, you're on. Right. I think should I get you guys a different point of view here? That's cool. Okay, a little cast iron. Okay. I'm talking to Thanks. So I am starting off the cast iron pans just because got to start somewhere. Hard to see where it says made in USA. It's so dark. I try and come up with some different angles, you know, that most people don't use. Well, how many angles can you actually come up with? Okay, we'll do one more with the tape measure. This. Taking pictures on a Thursday. One down, one to go. We got there. Back in a flash. 
favorite thing I've thrifted. I love thrifted toys. You know me, Casey. Ooh, a diamond. Can we can keep it? That's cool. I was catching up on the chat. These always remind me of like the olden days in the cartoons, you know, where or the wife would get a hold of one of these things and pa -ting, give the husband one of those. Because that could kill a dude, man. Jeez. That's crazy. All right. Um, I'm going to have to do a organization video and go through all my stuff. It's organized. It's out there. But it's kind of crazy. No, we're going to put this. Oh, what's that drawer that I had down here? Oh, it's upstairs. Uh, summer. Okay. Well, this is closed. Where's that ball? Is that right there? I'm worried about it. I know where it's at. Next is the Wagner six and a half inch skillet. Sir, I did not clean these things. Uh, maybe I should have. It's kind of sticky. But maybe I'll let the person do that themselves. Because I know there's a right way and a wrong way to take care of cast iron. Well, then what I should do is just Google it and find out the best way. It's tricky. It's tricky. It's tricky. tricky. Red pre season. Oil it. Oil it. Kind of vegetable oil. Crisco. Motor oil. 10 W40. No. Okay. Nothing. Huh. That's what we need to keep around the back door there. In case someone comes in, you go. All right, I'm going to take a picture of this A&M hat. It's a pretty cool hat. Text, I reckon. I reckon. Where's my head at? Where's my head at? There's my head. Everybody's got to have a head. And that was just, I wish every picture could be that quick. It zoomed right in, focused right up, and it was perfect. Wow. This little item really likes this lighting, I think. Because I'm not really having to do much. Except for take the picture. I like it. Dad, have you seen Bandit? No, I haven't, you? Mm -hmm. Better go find him. Make sure he's okay. Because I know he got into that. He got into the chicken. Open a can of food! That'll get him. Sorry, guys, you got me all freaked out. Bandit had jumped into the trash and 
had gotten into the chicken bones. I like lard. So larda or oil. Okay. I'll do that. Hey, Amelia Sells, now that you're here, or anyone else, you I showed this a long time ago, an hour ago in the hall, but it's called Creative Gear. Is that or is that not like a crafting thing? Like put all your doodads and dealing with bobs in here. Your beads and your brushes and your whatevers. You know, am I right? It's pretty cool. It's got a handle on it. Double-sided. has a hook. Let me new. Creative gear. Tired. Oh, poor baby. My baby cat is tired. Oh, the blankie. The blankie, baby. Okay. Here, this is what I do to get him out of tight corners so he doesn't get stuck. I always open it, like, because he's behind this elder picture. I always little, give him a little boost boost so he doesn't get stuck behind there. His tail gets caught on something, so I do that. So he's just black. Probably, it's probably because he um stayed up all night. Angie, come on. One size fits all. He's so cute. I can't really tell. But you see, he loves this when he's holding. Sometimes I just. Rock him back and forth. He wants to go to sleep. I'm gonna go in a, like, over here. So, I can move up. And now we're gonna probably take photos. I'm just trying to keep it. Okay. You want to do play? You want to do play? Hey. Eat it! You're just going to be playing with your sister. Well, this is the only time you're going to see me and my cat are going to be senior pictures. Even though I'm not a senior, we're going to just take some cute pictures. I love you. Yeah. You might have to help. I can't. Huh? I can't. I'm at work. Okay, then I'll do it somehow or another. But he's going to go in this. Bandit, no, you got to take your senior pictures. You're the only senior. He loves it, but he hates when I can carry both him because he's not tall enough to just take a picture with me. Here. Bye, Casey. Have a great night. Take care. Don't crap things. Bye, Casey. Carolyn says, Bye, Casey. My thrift did escape. There's Alma. What's up, Alma? How are you doing? I uh, did a little mini live haul. And now I'm just working, doing pictures and stuff like that. Caroline's playing with the cat. And that's that. I'm supposed to be taking pictures. So, I just came back from a little break. Okay, Muddy. It's time to get a picture of the buttercup. Oh, this thing needs to be cleaned. I gotta clean it. Bandit! So I'm not gonna do it now. Oh, that would be cute. I know, I just clean them. I can't take a picture of it. It's not clean. Let's do this Memories Forever book or whatever it is. Bandit! <laughs> this is that icon. You always, either when you open a can of food or. When he, when you hear, that means he's gonna come out. 
quick. Because he loves food. He's a chubby monkey. And he loves that sound. Oh, there he is. Oh, no. Flare going on there. Flare, man. There's a texture to it. Yeah, that seems nice. One, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Fifteen pages in there. And, uh, yeah. Dang it. Bang, bang, bang. Good angle. Shade of memories done. Glad I got this one. It's gonna sell pretty quick. Uh oh. I'm like, where am I gonna put it? How about right here? Kind of have a Tetris thing going now, guys. I don't know. Let's see here. Oh, bye, Amelia. I missed you. And you see how fast I go here and then I come back and we're gone. Okay, bye, Amelia. I'll see you later. I'm look right now. My daughter in the car watching on the phone. Well, thank you very much for sitting there in the car. You got out of the house. Oh my gosh. I'm just joking. Uh, me too. I like to listen to myself. Okay, get us. Yeah. We'll take a picture of the kids real quick. Yes. Here, let me use your phone. Yeah. Here, sit over there so we have a nice backdrop. Okay. Backdrop. It's like seeing your pictures, huh? Mm -hmm. Are you going to sit on here or are you just going to sit there? I'm going to sit on We're going to do a senior picture real quick for Caroline. Yeah, open. 
everything, huh? Yeah. Hey, this has a nicer camera than my phone. <laughs> Ready. Call it coming out. Okay. Call Candy Andrew. No, no, no. You're yeah. not gonna call mommy. No. No. See, don't she's, ever... she's really brave when it comes to that cat because I had a bad experience with him one time. Don't you ever I was holding on to him kick... like a baby, like this. I went to put him down, he freaked out and he went like this and he reached up and he clawed my eye and almost pulled my eyeball out. No, he didn't. He didn't pull, almost pull your eyeball out. He I, just... I thought he pulled my eyeball out. It was scary. You guys wanna see the pictures? They're really cute. He's trying to get out, but they're super duper cute. We took like six of them. Did it! Next is this memory. Don't ever give cats catnip. They'll freak Isn't out. Isn't that cool? I mean, that looks like a fairy tale book or something. It's wood. Whoa, look at that. Made out of two hunks of wood. Slabs of wood. Has a hinge in the middle. Should probably take that hinge up. Look at them. Yeah, funny, huh? So, yeah. You know, I think this is the perfect one. That way. Yeah. There it is. Where's my pledge? Or some kind of wood cleaner. I'm gonna go grab some pledge or some wood cleaner. Daddy, look over here. Now I need to go grab my baby because he he needs a nap. Otherwise, he's just gonna go like ah. So I need to take him for his nap time. He really hates it, but like I don't care because he has to take his nap. Like not a horrible parent for making my children take naps. Violet, are you gonna take a nappy? Are you gonna take a nappy? You wanna take a nappy? Violet, come here. No. I would rather be using some kind of like a lemon oil or something. And my I don't know like that. Violet, Violet, come here. Violet, lay down, lay down. Here, here. Oh, here, I'm gonna take it off here. I don't know how to lay down. Look, here, I'm just going to lay down. No, no, no. Lay down, lay down. I try and train our dog so we can tap the floor to go to sleep. Try and take a nap. <laughs> Usually she lays down, but doesn't want to. Violet, Oh, don't get your tail on me. Go to sleep. I want to see the selfie with her too. Violet, no, no. Where is she hurt? Okay, I'm calling that good. What do you mean by good? Good enough. I need it. Oh, I need it. You give me your
Thank you. Oh. You broke it. Oh, shows you pictures of your dolls. Wake them up. Oh no. Bye, Alma. I have to drive home now. Bye, bye. Have a good night. See you later. Be careful. Be safe. We'll see you soon. Comment cancel. Thanks for saying goodbye. I missed it. I was over here. <laughs> bye bye, everybody. At one point. No, I'm not going nowhere. She was gone. Um, bye, people that haven't. People that left are leaving. However, you say that. Yeah, I do not know. What a family would I got him to? I got him to. Sure, I did. What do you think it's going to go for? I don't know, because it's autographed. So I have to research it. I know. So tomorrow will be no picture taking day. You want this book? Nah, you don't need this book. It's weird. Okay, watch out. It is. It's called The Book of the Bizarre Freaky Facts and Strange Stories. Yeah. What's this? Freaky Facts. Did you know the Bible is the number one book stolen in the United States? Good. Everybody needs God, right? What? How do they get it? This is like one of those cases of powder things. This one is a hard one. Oh, this is getting a little puppy. I'm just taking pictures of books. Here, let me move the camera over here so we can be a little more up close and personal here. What's up? All right. We'll unplug you guys for a minute and set you down. Chill. Move this over here like this. Like that. Like this. Like that. And uh, uh, put this over here. Like that. Like that. 
this over here. So, oh, look out. Out of control. Light on your face. Yeah. So we can go without it. All right. Is that a little better? It's a book. It's a freaky book. Uh, this one's called The Book of the Bazaar. Um, yeah. This other book I got is really cool. I got to show you. Okay. So for one, it... Marty, you're back. What's up? Oh, man, I had a question for you. Uh, what was it? I don't know. I had a question. It took so long. Let's take pictures and videos. You're doing videos? Well, I haven't seen any videos. Check it out. Oh, are you doing like eBay videos? I want to start doing that. Anyway, this book is called The Pictorial History of the American Carnival. Okay. By Joe McKinnon. Volumes 1 and 2. It was purchased at Circus World Museum. Circus World Museum for 1999. It copywritten in 1972. Uh, 72. This is the actually the fourth, fifth printing. So 1983. But anyway, it's autographed by the author. So it's pretty cool. So we're gonna take pictures of that next. I don't see if there's anything in here. Take pictures of. Price tag out. You know. It's kind of like a, a little haze going on, huh? See that haze? A purple haze? If I can't, turn that light up over there, baby. See if I can change the haze. Please don't cat down. And it. He doesn't want to be carried like that. He doesn't want to. What light? That light. The main light. Yep. The main one. No, that one. Yeah. yeah. Try and test out something. Like here. Here. Really? Is that better? Is it worse? I don't know. Oh, here. Damn it, no, damn it. Damn it. Damn it. Damn it. There you go. Be interesting. Be strange. It. Yes, it did. I was excited about that. And that's still green. Okay, let's try something else. Turn it back on. Oh, I know what you should do. You should turn those lights off. And Yes. I'll just make sure we end it down and go in here. Put it behind me. If he does, he's probably driving. That. Oh, yeah, that's great. That works perfect. Um. Oh, what a control. No shine star. No matter who you are. Shine right to me. You can truly see. You can truly see. Shining star you are to me. What you think of two ladies? Let's see here. Come on. So that's that. <laughs> Let's be happy, Thrifter. What's up? Okay, yeah, I did see that last comment, but <laughs> yeah, it's because I'm old. Karma carousel. That's why. Um, let's be happy. What's up? Thanks for stopping in. This must be your first time because I don't remember seeing you in here before. Am I right? I'm right. Um, someone named Let's Be Happy Thrifter. 
If you haven't subscribed, do that because I would remember that. We're the same age, man. Oh, geez. Okay. So you're young too then. <laughs> what? This guy's only 45 years old. You know, I think 40, the 40s are the best. He's They're, younger than you. No, he's the same age. The 40s are the best. Well, you're both 45, aren't you? Well, it goes by really fast. Or are you 44, Dad? I am 45. I knew it. But don't tell nobody. I don't believe it most times. I already took pictures of this pin. They just go put away. Put this over here. You want a book to read? Mm -hmm. I have some cool books. The Simpsons comic book. Yeah. <clears throat> All right. Where are we at? What's next? <laughs> I put that away. I'm like, where are we at? I got to put my head away. We'll just grab this. And that's next. We'll grab this, and that's next. That over there. Then we'll grab these. And this. And don't get jammed up on what's next. Just grab something and take a picture of it. Right? That's right. How cool is that? 1955, baby. 1955. Dance party. It's before my time, but... Uh, yeah, that's cool. Turn the record around. Good. Could be cleaned up. What? Rag it. Because there was a... Oh, yeah. It needs to be dusted off. It's got 80 years of dust in his little. Word up. Look at that. Woohoo! It's lime green. It really worked nice. That makes it pop. She's popping now, boys. Hee hee. Christy. Hey, let's be happy. Now it's shiny. All right. So, I got a picture of this. I just try and get the ruler in every picture nowadays, you know? What the heck? Love is a many splendor thing. That's a song. No, duh, that's a song. But it's a song on here. And I don't know how I know that song. Is that from Greece at the end when they're flying away? Love is a many splendor thing. I could be wrong. I'm probably wrong. Somebody let me know if I'm right or if I'm wrong. Tokyo and Tulsa. Okay. Hey, what's up, Bobby Loves Coupon? Thanks for stopping in. I appreciate it. High fidelity, huh? Memory to this. Daddy-O. It's almost tomorrow. And Band of Gold. Band of Gold? We got to listen to that. Put it just quiet enough so I don't get in trouble. But if I remember right, that goes band of gold. It's a cool song. So we're gonna do, we're gonna break the rules, guys. You ready to break some rules? Breaking the law. We're gonna break the rules. I'm gonna put this record on for just a second. Just long enough to hear what's going on. 
and this cloth I'm using, it's an all around cloth. It's uh, actually for polishing. So it has a certain texture to it that it's good for just about everything without messing anything up. Although, I did have pledge on this. So, <laughs> but it is shining. She's shining, I'll tell you what, boys. I mean, girls. I mean, everybody. All right, let's go put this on the record player. Come on, let's go. It's going to be fun. Going in Caroline's room. Holy buckets. That's where Caroline ah! makes it. <laughs> She's like, she sits there, everybody. She's got her ear all set up. <clears throat> No, that's not it. Different song. Okay. Memories are made of this. Let's see. Okay. So that's at the dance dance party. Let's flip it over. Check it out. Uh, love is a many splendored thing. Let's see if we're right on that one. when they're flying away at the end of Greece. Um, yeah. Lord, is you guys want to hear something really cool? Okay, now, it looks like just a regular 45. And man, I don't know. Oh, this isn't it. Where's it at? I was jamming uh, right here. This is an old one. You can tell the difference between the records. Okay, see this one here? I know the lighting sucks in here. But that dog and that dog. That's the original right there. This is Treat Me Nice on a record from 1956. Okay. 1956 vinyl. And it just sounds so freaking awesome. Ready? I don't know how much I should play, but I guess I'm such a small tuber that no one's going to give me care. So ready? Here we go. Oh man. Guess I should turn it up first. You ready? <laughs> When I walk through that door, a baby be polite. You gonna make me sore if you don't treat me right. Don't you ever kiss me once, kiss me twice. I treat me nice. I don't let you be told it's not for me to tease. But if you go on a cold, you're really gonna freeze. If you don't want me to be cold as ice, here I got to cool move on. Treat me nice. Make me feel at home. If you really care, scratch my back and run your pretty fingers through my head. If you don't behave, I'll walk right out on you. If you want my love and take my advice, I'll trade you. Are you watching? 
I think I'm going to get banned. I might get banned. Oh, no. <laughs> All right. You guys have fun? You have fun? What's on this side? Jailhouse Rock. We've gone from an eBay show to a vinyl singing show. And I'm good with that. Oh, man. You guys can't probably see what that is, but you remember it. Hey, Picasso, you got back just in time. We're playing old vinyl. Ready? Uh uh. Check this out. Oh, man. <laughs> So that <laughs> my sister had that this on vinyl and I used to rock out to it. Okay, let's see who here's here that would understand this. Maybe Marty. Are you here, Marty? Or maybe you've heard this. I they played this at my grandma's 50th wedding anniversary. And when I saw, I know, huh? <laughs> uh check this out. It's called Eristu. I think one side is in English, one side Spanish. I don't even know the English side. Spanish. Seems to be more touching in Spanish for me. I don't even understand it. <laughs> But I do remember this. I was the uh, ring boy at my grandma and grandpa's 50th anniversary. So. <laughs> Anybody remember that one? My faves are the Carpenters and John Cassidy. Nice. See, she knows. Yeah, when I saw this, I could not believe it. I was like, wow, what are the odds that I'd ever find this? You know, and I know what it is. Pretty fun, folks. Okay, I do need to get back to work here, but I'm just having so much fun getting sidetracked. You know what I'm doing, actually, eBay? I mean, not eBay, YouTube. I'm not doing any copyright thing. 
what I'm doing is I'm doing covers and I'm testing vinyl live. That's what I'm doing. Still on. What's up, dude? Yeah, I'm still on, man. You know me. Sometimes I just go and go and go. I'm like the, the bunny. What's his name? Bugs Bunny. <laughs> there you go. As the snow flies. Man, that's a good one. On a cold and gray Chicago morning, a little baby child is born in the ghetto. Energizer, that's right. And his mother cries. But if there's one thing that she don't need is another mouth to feed in the ghetto. In the ghetto. People don't you understand? Child needs a helping hand. But he'll grow to be an angry young man someday. And take a look at you and me. Are we too blind to see? Or will we simply turn our heads and look the other way? Have some food. Later, Karma. Thanks for stopping in and hanging out. All right, one more and then I get to come back to it. Okay, but I was like, really? Called Flashback Records, 1976. So she's an original, and this was not my kind of thing, but people are going to recognize it. Ready? It's classic. There you go. Little Bay City Rollers, Saturday, 1976. What is this? Greatest name in entertainment, MGM. No. Work, Todd. Go back to work. Don't get sidetracked. But it's so fun. But I'm having fun. Doesn't matter. Get back to work. Okay. My boss is a jerk. He's really a jerk sometimes. He's like, get to work. Get to work. What are you doing? Don't be having fun. Yeah, who's my boss? Me. I have to be a jerk to myself and tell myself to get to work. Because otherwise, no one else is going to do it. So I'm right? your boss. <laughs> no. You hear that kid right there? I'm your boss. Got your yes, boss. I am your boss. So the dance party record was a hit. Got it completely off top off topic and off subject and off off my rocker basically, but been listening for a while while I work love to you. Nice. This is too laid back. <laughs> Yeah, totally, man. But I'm alone. I could just rock. I'm the best ever. Whose position? Oh, yeah, that's right. There you go. Yeah. All right, next. Am I going to go singing these or just going to put it on? Oh, man. Love and Marriage. You know that one. 16 Tons, which is. I got 16 tons. What do you get? One day something and deeper in debt. I hear you knocking. I don't know. I hear you knocking on my friend door. I don't know what that one is. Autumn leaves. I want you to be my baby. 17 and Maybelline. Maybelline. Why can't you be true? Say Maybelline. Why can't you be true? I got to take pictures of that last one. Shoot. You know, I think everybody can do a haul video and everybody can do a different video. And so I try and do stuff that's a little bit out there, a little bit different to uh, keep it changed up, man. You know, I got to 
trying to make myself, oh boy, am I doing this right? Maybe people, what are people going to think? I don't care. I'm having fun. That is when it's good. When you do what you want, when you want, and it doesn't matter. Yep. Life is good today. Life is good today. I see now, that's good. What? Well, there's something, what? About something o'clock. With a mm hmm, mm hmm, hmm. City still on my mind. How does it go? I got my toes in the water, ass in the sand. Not a worry in the world, a cold beer in my hand. Life is good today. Life is good today. What? Well, the train rolled up it's about four o'clock, and the city still on my mind. There's bikinis and palm trees danced in my head. Still in the baggage line. Concrete and color. All city summer, nigga. This life I'm living in. Man, I really don't know that song. <laughs> uh, I'm listening, listening. Yeah, that's yeah. You should be working. That's what I'm doing. What everybody should be doing, or not everybody, but you know, if you have work to do, do it. And if not, well then don't. But either way, you know. Yeah, I'm so, your monkey. 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 Your Okay, that's that, that's that. Bye, let's, oh, let's be happy. Um, easily sidetracked. Okay, bye bye. Take care. Working boss. <laughs> I hear you. <laughs> I was working, boss. I was working. I'm going to leave. Okay, what do you think of the record? I know. He's vital in there. Look how dirty you are. What kind of vegetables do we have for supper? Huh? Want corn, green bees, or peas? Corn. I'm cleaning. Dun, 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 dun. Sorry, I was getting quiet there. I had to gather my thoughts there for a moment, and uh, what I've come up with is uh, not much, not much going on. Hey, you know what songs I can sing without getting in trouble, Caroline? My own songs. I don't know. I could do in the country. You want to do it with me? We can sing it. You do backup. Okay, ready? I'll do the intro. In the country, my dad performed. Well, he never performed this. We're not getting crazy. Not going to do Okay, we'll just sing it instead. We have everything. In the country, we have everything that a man could ever need. We have orange sunrises and wild blue skies, fireflies and tall bonfires. 
where traditions run deep, been tilled in the land, simpler times, where I stand. And I thank God for this day, for my wife, my kids, and my family. And I just have to stop and say, as I look out towards the west, for me country living's best. It'll be gravel roads when my girls drive, baked corn and fried chicken grown right outside. We drive red, white, and blue because it matters to us. We're American boys. We drive American trucks. And it's the fresh air and watching the deer and a point buck in the misty morning. And I thank God for this day, for my wife, my kids, and my family. And I just have to stop and say, as I look out towards the west, for me country living's best. We will defend our land, believe we practice, man. Shooting at everything. Behind Grandpa's barn. Uh, our green bins have ten rings, and all my tractors are green. If you live in the country, you know what I mean. Do not tease him with that. That's not a toy. That's catnip. That will make him bonkers. No. Close it up and put it away. I ain't even trying to have him all popped up on the catnip. Have to put him to rehab or something. Jeez. Take him to rehab. Like those child stars when they get all hopped up on them whatevers. And they got to go to rehab. Try to make me go to rehab. I said no, no, no. Try to make me go to rehab. I said a no, no, no. Um... Just grab stuff over here to take pictures of. Gonna be next. <clears throat> well, first, gonna be this. Man, that's so cool. It's a nine cup coffee pot percolator. I was telling my mom about it, and she's like, You should use it before you sell it. Look at this thing. Isn't that cool? Very, 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 very neat. It's all glass, which is crazy. My mom's like, remember we used to have one? I was like, I know. I remember. You remember. I remember. You remember? I like, be very careful. Look, it's all glass. Uh, I think it'll part of this. Show all the pieces. There you go. And it's stuck. Okay, that's that. Let's put it back together without breaking it. But it's made out of Pyrex. I mean, you can put this stuff on top of the uh, Boutique Bear. What's up? Or I'm sorry, Bougie Bear. Bougie Bear Vintage. How you doing? I'm not seeing you here. Here. My mom said it makes good coffee. So I might have to try that. <laughs> cool. Sleep if they get asking me to, but if you don't behave, I'll walk right out on you. If you want my love, and take my advice. A tree me nice, I make me feel at home. If you really care. Scratch my 
back in your pretty fingers through my head. I think this has been taken apart and put back together. This is band on here is upside down. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. Yes, it is. Hey, yes, it did. <laughs> I cut myself up. All right. You guys talking over there? Fox. All right. Well, I know y'all just listening and working and working and listening. And that's good. That's what y'all should be doing. Working and listening. I'll tell you what, boys. Need to get our work going on here. Hey, man. I tell you what. Good old thing. It's like you're in I can't ignore him. Make it on eBay. Cool. Yeah. Uh, let's see. Here. I can't see the Sue's Pirates. I just can't get the right angle. Come on, baby. Angle for me. Come on. Got it. You know I'll be a slave. All right, done. Where will I put you? Where shall we go? Hey, with all this left there. I thought I sold it. Oh boy. Oh boy, I had to say. Ooh, it's getting chilly down here now. All of a sudden, I got the goosebumps. <coughs> Excuse me. Matter of fact, I got chills and multiplying. <laughs> I'm done. Hey, look at that thing shine. Sparkle and shine. You know what? I take it back. I'll never be done singing. Sparkle and shine. That's a different song. I could have. Always pick the dog you find. Be I wasn't what you had in mind. But I can love you, I can love you, I can love you not. Yeah. I can love you, I can love you, I can love you not. Yeah. She says I'm the one she really wants. But I'll never be the the one that she needs. I'm not here to thrill you. I'm just okay. Got to get the picture of that, right? Yes. That. Oh, don't you even tell me that. Ding, ding, ding. I'll tell you what. Mercy. He's bound down, loaded up and trucking. We gonna do what they say can be done. We got a long way to go. Any short time to get there. He's bound, just watch old bandit run. I'm just, you know, got random things popping through my head, so I'm just singing it. What's that one? Come and, <clears throat> come and knock on my door. Take a step that is new. Three's company, too. Three's company too. Ooh, 
do 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 Man, <laughs> uh, that's funny. That is funny, guys. I think because I almost caught myself saying, "Man, if Rakin Prophet or Bonafide Hustler are watching, they'd be saying, what in the heck is this guy doing?'" And then I just told myself, "You know what? I don't care. I don't care." <laughs> it's awesome. I love it. Feels good. That feels good. You don't have to like me. I like myself. All right, Tonka baby. Tonka. Oof. How many measurements do you need of this thing? None, right? All right. Um, let's see if I can get a cool one in the cockpit. No, because it's pretty. Get the underneath a bit. Color good. Okay. Guess I should read here. Let's see here. Hi, buddy. Brilla Prince Hey, thanks for joining us. Let's just take a break. Excited to tune in. Thanks for tuning in. I love coffee. Me and those old pipe right out. Um, have a good night. Time for dinner. Goodbye, Bobby. Love to coupon. I'm like three minutes late. You're probably gone. Uh, you sing all your work. I play musical. I work. Usually, I have a lot of music. Uh, usually. I do play music. Um, I throw on some records, whatever. But since I'm on here, I can't really throw on records and just let them buck because I think I get in trouble. So I did play some records earlier, and maybe I'll get in trouble. Maybe I won't. Whatever. But uh, yeah, I do listen to music usually. And that's why I'm glad I found my little iPod dilly. So now I can just rock out and sing my guts out, and no one's going to care. Well, except for the dog. So Caroline knows that song in the country. And she's known it since she was a little girl. And when she was like five, to hear her sing, it was crazy. In the country. All right, done. Let's call that 32 bucks. We're going to park it right here. Right here. Yeah. When supper, when mom gets home, is when supper is. I'm hungry. Mom, go upstairs and have a snack until she gets here. I don't want a snack. Well, then you're going to have to wait. You're going to have to wait. I'm not going to stop just to go upstairs and make supper, and then you're going to go, oh, I'm not going to eat. What time is it? 5.48. Which means mom should be home in a little bit. I don't even know where my phone's at. You? I'm right over there. Hasn't made any noise. Where's that? Okay. Uh, so yeah, I'm gonna break the rules and take a picture of this auto bo otter box and go from there. See if I can sell it. Don't get in trouble. Stylish protection. Or uh, iPhone 5. What series are they on there? Like iPhone, iPhone 29 or something? It is two. Oh. It is two. It is two. It is two. Ah, oh, man. So what happened is, it's probably not even for an iPhone 5 for all I know. What happened is someone got a new OtterBox and then just threw this one in here, I think. Possibly, because this is not new. Definitely used. Oh, yeah, it's even torn down here. It's jacked up. That it is. But it was 50 cents. So, you know, I don't know. That sucks. I hate when people do stuff like that, man. You have to be careful. See what's in there. Yeah, this isn't even it. Or is it? I can't tell. Looks like that is getting, might take a trip out to the farm and get blown up. 
Because it's broken, man. It's broken. Or can that one little rubber piece be replaced? I don't know. It's even worth it. It's got a screen protector in there, though. Screen protector, an otter box, squeegee, and a thing. Okay. It um, doesn't say. That's lame, man. Oh well, not gonna worry about it. Not gonna trip. It's just one of those things. Pocket in business, fifty cents. What are you gonna do? It's my fault for not looking closer. That's what I get. I just saw OtterBox, and yeah, that's what I get. Live and learn. Let's go for some bone on my thigh, man. How am I gonna get a scar like that, Eden? I'm a political refugee, and I want my human rights, man. World is mine, Chico. And everything. The only reason I bought these movies is because they're unopened. So I don't even have to mess with are they scratched or are they not scratched? Definitely not like a huge one maker, but it's. Take it to the limit. Limit. Dun, 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 Take it to the limit. Limit. You just gave a lesson on what to look for. Yeah. Open everything up. <laughs> I had a, a game. The only game that I was happy about in that whole lot um, of those video games was that NASCAR game. And it wasn't in there. And I was like, dang. Okay, this one is Coraline from the directors of The Nightmare Before Christmas, which was who? Tim Burton, I believe. Hey, that's a good song, I believe, by uh, Joe Satriani. I believe. Oh, and then there's Don Williams. I believe. Organic food. Food. I like to think. I can remember how it goes now. But I believe in love. I believe in babies. I believe in mom and dad. And I believe in you. I don't believe virginity is as common as it used to be. In working days and sleeping nights. Black is black, white is white. Superman and Robin Hood are still alive in Hollywood. Gasolines and short supply, the rising cost of getting by, but I believe in love. Rated R, not for the kiddies. Pictures do you need of a movie, right? Yeah, Don Williams. Good stuff. Or how about? <clears throat> well, you get down the fiddle and you get down the bowl. Kick off your shoes and you throw them on the floor. Dance in the kitchen till the morning light. Losing in a Saturday night. Make it down the bell and get down the bow. Get the off the shoes and get on the floor. Stands in the kitchen in the morning light. Hey, that was cool. I looked at my clock and said 555. Five. 5.55. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Me and my mom are going to get off the bed. Make a, make a little something in the sun, moonlight. Louisiana Saturday night. Hey, get down the feeling. That's the whole song, just the chorus. 30 minutes, 1985. Holy. 
storybooks brought to life Princess of Power, which was what part of She-Ra, Sword of She-Ra, Glimmer of Hope, and The Fear Factory. 1985. All right, all right, all right. All right. I guess it, I guess as a lover, I have a way to go. If I'm home, you should just say it's so. If I'm home, something on the radio. Listen to the radio. Oh, listen to the radio. Let's spend the night together. They don't go. Sing it on the radio. The words they say. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Man, that's pretty mellow, mellow, whatever, huh? I need something harder than this. Listen to some, uh, I want to hear my head. <laughs> Are you guys working? I'm like, someone over there? I feel like there's somebody watching me, man. <laughs> There is. Uh, I know, I forget about it. And then I'm like, hey, I can feel eyes on me. And I, I had to look. <laughs> it was weird. What's that one? Man, now I'm getting hungry, Caroline. It's all Caroline's fault, guys. Did it. Those are some ladies' shoes that have a hook and loop velcro with the box. So like this, and then wrap them back up, put them all back together like they're new. Can this goes in there. This that this Let's see if I could jam back in the bag. Yeah. Gotta wiggle it, wiggle it just a little bit. Something is missing here. Huh. Never use the V word. Yes, it is hook and loop or sticky fuzzy loop. But yeah, never use the the V word. It, you have the V word. That's funny. It's the hair. Nah, man. Yeah, I shaved my head. No, I'm just joking. I didn't. I'm just giving my follicles a, a break. Elon Kisses, what is up? How you been? It's one of my original. She's an OG. OG subscriber. Matter of fact, she might have been one of my first subscribers. I remember, right? Is that right? I'm right, I'm right, I'm right. Okay, no pair of shoes. One down, one to go. Put that right there. Now I'll bust these Stuart Weisman. Weitzman's. This there, good man. I'll see you in a sec. I know what are you been up to. 
I've been here making videos and going live and doing group video haul thingies with all kinds of people. It's pretty cool. Slowly but surely expanding my realm. I should be getting home here directly. She hasn't messaged me. Although, the air conditioner went at the store today, I guess. So that's never fun. I'm like, that's not good. That's not very good. Oh, look at that. That's cool. And I didn't even clean these guys. How about that? Because they just look like shoes. Like that. You can get rid of this, so you can get rid of that. So you can get rid of this, so you can get rid of that. Or how about? Oh man, no. Lots of nice pair of shoes. <laughs> How many pictures do I need of these? I think I'm good. I'm like that. I'm like this. Like that. Like this. And like this. Bring the lights down here. Bring the lights down low. When the lights go down. In my city, it's dark, and the sun shines out the bed. Well, you want to be there yeah, in my city. Oh, 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 See, I've almost got this whole thing. Oh no, I was wrong. <coughs> Excuse me. I was wrong. Hey, did I picture that? I did yesterday. I pictured these yesterday. This got pictured yesterday. That got pictured yesterday. Let's do some belts. Let's do some belts. And then I should probably do those. Crown Royal bags. I've got 32 for the Crown Royal bag. Journey, love them. Don't bless them. That. <laughs> but yeah, I like them too. I would just get done saying, don't. It don't matter what anybody thinks. Yep. Like them. Like them. Tell the world. If the world don't like it, yep. Give them one, of, one finger off each hand. And then that. All right, pack of cards, a deck of cards, Fargo North, from the Fargo North Code of VA, VA Veterans Association. So these are cards from the VA in Fargo. I don't know if that's collectible or not. I'm glad they're made in the United States of America. That would suck. They weren't, right? I don't know what's on them. Or nothing. Just says poker size. <laughs> poker size. <laughs> yeah. Poker size. Poker. Poker face. All right. That's that. We play with some keychains, folks. Here, baby, here's a keychain for you. You got all blinged out. Look. You like them? Okay, first is a guest keychain. It's a guest keychain. Oh man, that's shiny. 
That's Janey Janey. Right, now. I could use my t-shirt, but I'll bust up the rag. Blinded by the light. So, so you think you can tell your heroes from ghosts? Hot ashes, hot ashes from trees. Cold air for a cool, or hot air for a cool breeze. Cold comfort for change. Did you explain? Or did you exchange? Walk on part in the war, but lead role in the cage. How I wish, how I wish you were here. We're just two lost souls swimming in a fishbowl year after year. Go around the same old town. How you found same old fears. Wish you were here. Todd, you got any recordings? Uh, I do. I do. But it's nothing that I let that I would put out there. Because the song that I have recorded recorded is not uh well oh man, it's a hard rock. I don't even know if you've heard it, Charles. Pretty scary. <laughs> Back in the day. <sighs> It's a good song, but it's just every time I, I listen to it, I played it like a month or two ago. I think I haven't sang it, busted it out. But after I do, it brings me down, man. That song has so much energy and power that it's a little too much for me to even handle. So I don't even play with it anymore, you know? Which is crazy. But this is a villager keychain, and I believe it's going to go to Mercury Villager, which is not much of a band. But. Uh, you never know. Verizon Wireless. That's Mama's ring, I can tell. It's a regular ring, but... Hola. Hello. <laughs> What's up? Are you here? Oh, I guess it's like I'm parked in the middle of the driveway. Okay, I'll go up right there. Bye. Parked in the middle of the driveway, guys. In the middle? Yeah. I was going to pull my car in, but then I didn't. So, I'll be back. He'll be back. He'll be back.
I move my car. Bias one picker. Low key lime kisses. How do Tim see on They've been. How do you get in? I'm back. I'm back. I'm probably gonna do another 10 minutes and then go get supper going. So, I just wanna finish up these last few pictures. And then we'll call her a day, guys. And it will have been a productive day on my end. I hope you guys have been productive on your end. Which I know you are. Here, like that. Da, da, da. This is the United States Deputy Sheriff's Association keychain with a. It's like a, some kind of a lacquer. A lacquer slacker. All right, let's see. Come on, zoom, baby. All right, what's that? Do, 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 do. Yeah, I parked right in the middle of the, <laughs> the driveway. Time just got away from me, man. I didn't realize. That this is a pretty cool keychain. So you're not gonna get rip off keychains, but to me they're like ties. You know, a lot of people sell ties as filler. To me, keychains are filler. Uh, you know, I pay next to nothing for them, and I'll get you know 10, 15, 20 bucks out of a keychain, which is pretty crazy. If you think about it. But there's collectors for everything. I'm sure there's people out there that collect lint, you know? Yep, productive on my end. Awesome, Charles. Good, good, good. My intent for these videos is not to, to waste your time. It's to uh, occupy your time. And give you something to listen to or laugh at or whatever uh, while you're working. Because that's the same thing I do with everybody else. When I'm taking pictures, if I don't have music going, I'll be watching The Bearded Picker or one of you guys, you know. So, so by the way, Marty and Charles and Tina Wright. Hey, what's up, Tina? 609, you were in here. I don't know if you're still here or not, but... Uh, When are you guys going to throw some videos up? Mm -hmm. Going to put some videos up. Do, 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 do. That was way shinier. That's shiny. National Law Enforcement. That's cool. I like that. <laughs> she's funny. She just busts out laughing sometimes. Like, what are you laughing at? And she's got her headphones on, so then I know. All right, Charles, we're going to go do about another eight minutes here. And then we're going to call it. They're just so easy to take pictures of. Oh, got a snag. Dang it, dang it, dang it. All right, it's guardian angel. Like this. That's really dark.
Sometimes I have to go like this so I can concentrate. Let me concentrate. Sticky, sticky, sticky. Driving down a country road, trying to make a living. So I'm knocking on doors every day. So if I should happen to stop on by and talk to you. Please don't slam that door in my face. Cause I'm a salesman. Meeting strangers, becoming their friend. I'm a salesman. Daddy, what's supper? Mama's upstairs right now fixing it, I reckon. Or I'm kind of short and I'm gonna get upstairs and get on it. Either way. <clears throat> That was a little song I wrote when I was driving on the country road, trying to make a living. <laughs> and I was selling insurance in the middle of nowhere. And it used to go really fast. It was like driving down a country road, trying to make a living. So knocking on doors every day. So if I should happen to stop on by and talk to you, please don't slam the door in my face. I'm a salesman, meeting strangers, becoming their friend, but it got slowed down somewhere along the lines. Okay, got pictures of that. Good, good, good. Uh, black and brown. Oh, right there. Here's another one. It's 54. This one has been used a little bit more. It's just a plain black belt. Black boots. Number one here. Oh, I hate getting my hand in there. I hate it, I hate it, I hate it. What? Getting my hand in the picture. Because that's just not my thing. Everybody gets their hand in their picture. Not me. Oh, uh, yeah, everything. Not me. Even me. Because once when I was taking pictures, I did. Well, some of you. He's what? What's the, what do you mean peeing you off? Okay. Say that then. Okay, belt number two. Yeah. <clears throat> what is this one? This one is a little more worn. Dockers. So let me just throw this up there real quick. Caroline, that's what we got for supper. Remember I told you? Dun, dun, dun. 
trying to get a picture of this uh, logo. The Docker is nothing special, but come on. Maybe I need a little more light. picture to get. That was tricky. Alright, that's that. Let's file that one right there. This is a cool belt. It's heavy duty leather with uh, orange stitching. So this is a 54 You know, it's crazy. I picked up a bunch of 54 inch jeans yesterday. Or 50 54s. So, yeah, it's kind of neat. <clears throat> we take them upstairs with that, please. I'm almost done here. It's hard to get. It's hard to get that. The cat was giving us a little show. <laughs> Probably was. I'll have to go back and watch that. He's a good cat. But he's a cat. No, cats are. There we go. Oh, okay, there we go. So it's getting frustrated. I must be getting hangry. I need to go eat. There we go. Target. Come on. Shine to it. Um, man, it's a big belt. I can't even get it on the picture. That. Oh, I gotta get the inside, right? This is made by Scandia Woods USA. That is. The black. Black. Oh boy, guys, we got a lot of stuff pictured today, didn't we? Yeah. Keyring stuff. Scroll stuff. All right. Uh, well.
Well, we made it, folks. 637. Some of you have been with me since uh, 317. No. Well, since a long time ago. <laughs> this whole thing started at, well, three hours and 18 minutes ago, I guess. But uh, I have to do a 24-hour one of these days. What do you think of that? Who? Well, there's like two people here now. But if you're watching this after the fact, if you made it this is far, if you fast forward to it, you should put down there in the comments after the fact uh, if we should do like a 12-hour show or an 8-hour show or a 24-hour show. 24 hours would be crazy. Maybe if when I hit 1,000 subscribers, I do a 24-hour show. That's a good goal. That is a good goal. All right, guys. Well, uh, I got a lot done. I hope you did, too. I appreciate each and every one of you for watching today um, and in the future. So I'd like to say thank you to a bunch of people. Marty, thank you. Uh, Charles, thank you. Tina Wright, thank you, Tina. Keelan Kisses, thank you. And I'll thank people that are probably not here. I'm going to thank people like... Amelia set or uh, Amelia sells. Thank you. My thrifted escape. Thank you. Hi, by the who else? Swan picker. Thank you. Uh, I don't know if there's a bunch of you guys, but thank each and every one of you. If you haven't hit that thumbs up, do that before we roll out because apparently that's important. I don't know. I don't know. So here we go, guys. We're out of here. Have a wonderful day. And I'm going to go upstairs, have some chicken, and then go list. Go check out my, uh, what do I want to go have them check out? Your YouTube channel? No, they're on my YouTube channel. Go check out my store. You don't have to buy nothing, but go check it out. I want people to look and see, and you see it, you know, Trend and Treasures, T-R-E-N-D-O-N, Trend and T-R-E-N-D-O-N, Treasures. And you'll find my stuff, and then next time we chat or get in here, you'll say, hey, Todd, I like this or that, or, man, you need to change that, because I found a listing today that I had up there for $2,599. Yeah. I put the comma. I put a comma in the wrong spot, and anyways, it was all jacked up. Todd's eBay. Check her out. Look at that. She ain't even playing. <laughs> Puts it right there. That's good. Thank you very much, my moderator, Marty. You guys have a good day. Hey. Give me and stream. Come on. I got to work this thing. Got to learn how to work my.